Look, everybody, it's the PRD agenda. Holding it right in front of you. Directors off to go through the PRD agenda Thursdays, every second Thursday. They gather, they break bread, they discuss the issues of the ratepayers of the land, the expenses of the tax base, and where to best spend that money. Meetings sometimes go five, six hours. Why spend five, six hours when you can spend five, six minutes right here with the Dawson Creek Mirror Editor as we break down the highlights and the hot items on the agenda. Of course, the hottest item, as always, what our director is eating for lunch. What do we understand? It's a bit of a potluck. One of the directors will be bringing some apple smoked ribs with the cornbread side. Brad Spartan's bringing in some blue ras Kool Aid. And Dale Bumstead's bringing us some Royale with cheeses and some hater tots. Before they jump into the regional board meeting, they always have a cow meeting, which is, of course, the committee of the whole meeting prior to the PRD directors meeting proper. Two highlight agenda items this week for your first summer PRD agenda rundown. The CFO for the PRD, Roxanne Shepard, will be guiding the flock through the PRD investment update portfolio could be a hot one there and healthcare scholarship discussions on the cow then of course Brad God of Thunder Sparling will drop the hammer and begin the regional board meeting proper first up 1045 before directors get into too many delegate uh, too many agenda items the only delegation of the group the canoe procurement group of Canada is going to be talking about their group purchasing program through the power and technology of a PowerPoint presentation, of course, then. Eager Beaver reporters can answer who is Canoe, how can they help, by cutting and pasting this PowerPoint presentation. Procurement. That's just a fancy word for buying of items. Stay tuned for that presentation. Then the Directors will be moving into correspondence. The City of Fort St. John is requesting a letter of support regarding coolie remediation. And then BC Hydro has a correspondence concerning one one electric vehicle charging stations. Get with the times, so to speak. A few reports of note. Uh, Electoral Area Directors Committee meeting recommendations include a letter to be drafted and sent to Ag Minister Lana Popham, and as well for work and more work uh, to continue on the Don Nearhood Museum display out in Buick. Of course, an RFQ award was awarded for share sheds for the Bestboro and Chetwin landfills and, of course, the Dawson Creek Landfill Transfer Station. Who won the award? You guessed it, Celtic Construction. We've got a Gotta Go Memorandum of Understandings and a Mutual Aid Agreement Renewal between Charlie Lake and Taylor Fire Departments as well. North Peace Fall Fair Tent Rentals and then of course a key one update on the North Peace Fall Fair and the Adeline Kelly Building Engineer Investigation. I'm getting the gumshoes out on this one. Uh, report's going to be due and ready, prepared mid-August. Of course, won't be up until the September eighth meeting and then there's a trio trips subdivision of lands within the ALR one south of Dawson Creek one north of Presbyterian and one northeast of Dawson Creek and then there's an exclusion uh, proposal from the ALR as far as lands are concerning and that is immediately west immediately west of Fort St. John then we get into some development permits Pretty standard business. Uh, bylaw enforcement policy update concerns public um, hearing procedures and then having comments from officers. Alaska Highway news disbursements, second quarter financial updates, personal vehicle use allowance before they jump into some again uh, bylaw work, then a consent calendar and into the final page as far as again letters. Thank you letters from the PRD health scholarship winner and a few other housekeeping items well there you go why spend four five six hours with PRG directors starting at 10 o'clock this morning and of course we'll have it in the feed as well right below here but why spend those five or six hours when you can spend five minutes with us five minutes right now <laughs> 